Nothing like cold calling and a cold one. All right. Hey, Stacy. Hey, Bethany. Hey, Julia. Hey, this is Ryan from Tinder. Hey, thanks for taking my call. Hey, this is Ryan Keating. Uh, the reason for my call is I'm looking for a wedding date. I, I know it's been a while. Uh, I sent you a few texts. Is I'm looking for a date for a wedding in the Cape, and I would love for you to join me. No, no, we never met. But uh, I sent you too many texts. Your Facebook said you're single too. You thought I was too aggressive. What do you mean? Well, why am I calling you now? Oh, is I'm looking for a wedding date. Oh, you hate weddings. Uh, I just wanted to call and say hi. I didn't know you were married. Uh, how do I get your number? Guys buy you drinks all the time. Well, I'm not just any guy. Oh, yeah, I'm still single. You're not surprised? Hello? 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 Hey, Bob. Yeah. No, no, I haven't found a date yet. I'm trying. The, the, lead, the leads are old. I, I need the Glengarry leads. And probably some coffee. But, yeah. Look, I need to go, though. I have to make a video on becoming a cold-blooded killer for their protege. No, no, it's not another hunting thing. No, no, it's not a cult. Well, maybe it's a cult. He has an insurance thing. There's 10 contestants, so I'm doing an application video to be a contestant, and then the winner of that will be the protege. No, I know Dad's great. He's an amazing insurance agent and a great mentor, but he talks about conversion coverage and UM all the time. Yeah, so it's gonna be great. It's gonna help show the industry that pale, stale, and male is not the way it goes anymore. You need to be young, innovative, and part of a diverse group of people that are changing the way. And one of the best parts too about this is the founder of Killing Commercial, he's also an insurance agent, yeah, David Carruthers. He's actively involved in running his company and would be a great mentor to learn from. He even had me on his Power Producers podcast. And I think from that podcast, we talked about Marcus Simonis, the show The Profit I really like, and how he was looking for an apprentice. So I think I gave him this idea. The thing I'm most excited about to participate as a finalist is it gives me the opportunity to have a fresh start from how I've learned the commercial insurance industry so far. Being a final student changed the trajectory of my career. Yeah, no, I mean, I know I'm doing very successful so far and working very hard, but the last couple of years I've been building relationships with a lot of great people in the industry and being a part of the protege, it would expand that network and I'd be able to develop more relationships with other agency owners and business owners in the local community. People like to support people. Yeah, I know, I know people know me pretty well in town, but social media has been great and there's gonna be a lot of publicity around this with just the fun competition. So yeah, by participating in this, I'll be exposed to a whole world of commercial insurance. Yeah, yeah, so I can sell the businesses better. But I, I agree, things are earned. Yeah, you have to work hard and seize the opportunity. Yeah. Uh, you want one's dinner? Okay. All right. Talk to you soon. Bye. As Johnny Lawrence says, you gotta flip the script. So, thank you for watching my video. I hope you had some fun and got some laughs out of that. How trying to get a date or pick up girls is a lot like cold calling for insurance sales. So. I look forward to participating in the protege and bolstering some fun competition in my industry on a national level with my peers. You should pick me as a finalist because I am relatable to many out there in the insurance space as independent agents looking to make the jump from personal lines or a small business commercial into that middle market cold blooded killer space. So I know it will be a lot of fun for people watching and enjoying the journey and I would be a great contestant because of that. By being a finalist, <clears throat> the trajectory of my career would definitely see a bump. Um, it would help put me and my confidence level on a feeling that cannot be explained right now. Thank you again for the time. Hope you had some laughs. See you in Tampa.